Hi friends, welcome to Animal Law. In this video, we are going to talk about the Pitbull Terrier, a velvet power. If we want to talk about the history of the Pitbull Terrier, we have to go back to the 18th century in England. Pitbulls are a breed of old bulldogs that were used in Britain for dog fighting. This involved two Pitbulls attacking a bull for hours until the bull gave up. Why is this British dog famous for being American? During the Britain Civil War, many British immigrants brought pit bull to the United States where the breed was registered as the American Pit Bull Terrier. In 1898, the UKC, Britain's equivalent of the AKC, named these bulldogs the American Pit Bull Terrier. These dogs love people and have no idea that their size is something of a deterrent to being a lap dog. Confident and keenly aware of their surroundings, they are watchdogs in that they may alert you to the presence of strangers. But that's primarily because they are eager to greet their guests. American Pitbull Terriers are generally healthy, but as with all breeds, they're prone to certain health conditions. Not all American Pitbull Terriers will get any or all of these diseases, but it's important to be aware of them if you're considering of these breeds. But it's important to be aware of them if you're considering this breed. They may suffer from hip dysplasia, allergies, hypothyroidism, and heart disease. Regardless of how healthy your dog is when you first bring them home, you should prepare for any issue that may come up throughout their life. A pet insurance plan can help you stay ready for any of your dog's veterinary needs. Expect to spend about an hour a day walking, playing with, or otherwise exercising his dog. While they love people, American pit bull terriers are strong for their size and can be stubborn if left to their own device. Begin obedience training early and continue it throughout the dog's life. Training is the foundation for a strong relationship with your American Pit Bull Terrier. American Pit Bull Terriers, they should not be left outside for long because they can't tolerate the cold well. Even regardless of climate, these dogs do best as house dogs. They form a strong attachment to their families and will suffer if left alone for a long period. The short coat is skinny and stiff to touch and comes in all colors, red, brown, gray, black and white and brindle among them. They require little grooming and have a coat that easy to keep clean with the occasional bath. Brushing with a stiff brush and wiping down with a cloth will maintain the coat shine. Pitbulls love children. Sturdy, energetic, and tolerant, they are ideal playmates. That said, no dog of any size or breed should be ever left unsupervised with children. When no adult can be there to observe what's going on, dogs should be crated or canaled, especially after they reach sexual maturity when they may begin to test the personality of being pack leader. Don't allow children to fool on a dog's ear or tail. Because of their dog fighting heritage, some American people retain a tendency to be aggressive with other dogs. But if they are socialized early and trained to know what behavior is expected of them, that aggression can be minimized or overcome. Just to be safe, they should always be supervised in the presence of other pets. What do you think about this lovely dog? Tell us in the comments. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching.